Hey, what's going on everybody? Today, we're gonna go over a heavily asked question. What is the weight difference between a carbon fiber roof and a steel roof? That's got the assembly, all that weight. Everybody keeps giving weight online and you know, giving numbers and whatnot, but nobody can seem to prove those numbers. Well, that's what this upload's for. And if you're interested, stay tuned. All right, this is my personal parcel scale. This is something that I use to weigh out anything that I need to ship out. And in this instance, we're going to use it to weigh these parts. Now, everybody's always wondered how much the steel roof weighs and how much the actual moon roof assembly or sun roof assembly actually weighs itself. Now, the only thing that I've actually removed from this assembly is the four rubber hoses that extend off of each point. And we're not going to weigh those out because really that's kind of minuscule. We're really looking for the actual and factual weight of each part. Okay, so due to poor lighting, we're going to go ahead and zoom in on this actual roof replacement. So it's made of dry carbon, and it's made by Marsh Composites. This one just happens to be serial number 173. And this is the OEM roof skin. And as you can see, the entire mating section where all the plug welds are still attached, and all I've done is drill them out so that I could separate from the actual car itself. So everything is here, other than the uh, the tiny little coins that were here and the plug welds, but the part itself is a hole. So with that said, we're actually going to be able to get this as close as possible with actual weight. Okay, so real fast, I'm going to go ahead and explain my process. I've got the scale on the floor, and I've got all the parts inverted and leaned up against the actual bench behind it. Now, they're basically leaning just enough to where they won't fall over and just enough to where they're just barely touching the bench itself. So this is going to relieve a lot of tension and be able to just slide this parcel scale underneath each and an individual part themselves and get a factual weight. All right, so I think this is going to be the best option. That way you guys can actually see what's going on. So we're going to go ahead and lift this part straight up. Slide this scale underneath. Everything still seems to be zeroed. And then we're going to set it down. Centered. And it looks like we are looking at 6 pounds... 3.9 ounces. All right, now time for the steel. So as you can see, everything's been zeroed out. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna lift this part up, center the scale, set it right down. Just bear with me, it's not as light as the carbon. Ow! And it's a little sharp too because you got all these plug welds. All right, bear with me. There we go. That's his balance so it doesn't fall. Wow, it looks it already looks like it wants to fall over. So that's as straight up as I can get it. All right, uh, looks like 26 pounds and one ounce on the dot. So now it's time to do the sunroof assembly. I'm gonna go ahead and grab it here and set it onto the scale. Straight up. And it looks like we're around a 27 pound, 11, almost 12 ounce mark. All right, so now let's think about it. With the combined weight of this steel panel and this glass assembly, we're looking at 53 pounds and 13 ounces. Six pounds and four ounces for the carbon fiber replacement. This assembly here, these two together, that's 8.3 times heavier than what you're going to replace it with. That's amazing. So if you're looking at it in a ratio aspect of shaving weight and bringing all that weight down and not sitting up at the top now, and now you don't have so much when you turn because all the weight is now on the bottom of the car as it should be. Wow. These things have purpose? They're functional? 
All right, all jokes aside, I hope you guys enjoyed the upload. I tried making it as informational as possible. That way you guys have a broader you know, understanding of what these things actually weigh. Actual numbers. Not something you're going to find on the internet. Not something you're going to find on YouTube. This is something that I actually made the search for and tried finding. And a lot of people are just putting out a lot of numbers and really can't prove them. So in those aspects, that's really what this upload is for so that you can come back to this and prove to others when this conversation comes up online because it's going to happen many times down the road. I promise you that's just the way people are. They don't like to Google. They don't like to look up their own information. And this is going to be something for you to be like, oh, hey, I remember I watched that. Here it is.